Yes, yeah, Sharon, for Downey police officers, this is personal. One of their own was killed right here in the parking lot at the Downey police station several years ago. And they say that one of the men that was involved in the murder is now about to be released in just a few years, all because of this new law. As long as I'm alive, I will never let Ricky's memory die, and I will never let the Senate bill go down. Corporal Ralph Diaz will never forget the day his best friend, police officer Ricky Galvez, was shot to death outside the Downey police station in a botched robbery attempt. That was over three years ago. Just last month, Abel Diaz told a juvenile court judge he was involved in Galvez's murder. He's now 20 years old. But instead of facing serious prison time or worse, because of a brand new, little known law, Diaz will be released likely by the time he's 23. Mr. Diaz was not some innocent kid caught up in the moment and an accident occurred. He actively participated with even his face partially covered to hide his identity in the murder of Ricky. How in the world can Mr. Diaz be released out into our community in the next few years? It's really unbelievable. Senate Bill 1437 passed January 1st. It basically allows those who are involved in a murder but who didn't actually pull the trigger an early release with little to no jail time. Some argue even though Abel Diaz was armed, he was just shy of 17 at the time of the murder and shouldn't be exposed to years in state prison. Corporal Diaz, now the president of the Downey Police Officers Union, says he and others across the state plan to fight this new law one city at a time. Not just because of his best friend's memory, but for the safety of Californians who have no idea that because of SB 1437, those involved in murders could end up back on the streets not long after the crimes are committed. The hope is to have it changed. Um, and if we can't have it completely overturned, um, at, at least maybe meet and happy somewhere in the middle. And Corporal Diaz says he, he knows that he has a long battle ahead of him, but he is encouraged. Uh, he says that there's a big uprising against this law. In fact, there's even talk, he says, of a lawsuit against the state of California for passing the law. He encourages everyone to get involved. That's the very latest from Downey. Back to you guys in the studio.